Ang programang ito ay rated M A T H. Ang kop sa mga batang gustong matuto, maging alerto, talentado at laging handa. Isang magandang araw po sa ating lahat. Ako muli si Teacher Ray at narito tayo ngayon sa Mathinker Studio upang maghatid ulit ng panibagong aralin sa Mathematics 5. Kaya kung ikaw ay gusto mong matuto, maging alerto, talentado at laging handa, dito ka na sa Mathinker Studio. Dahil dito, marami kang matututunan. Okay, so before we proceed to our topic for today, let us have a quick review on a rename mixed number to improper fraction. Okay, so number one, five and three fifth. If we are going to convert this into improper fraction, it will become twenty-eight. Over five. Paano nakuha yan? Okay, you simply multiply the denominator by the whole number. Then the product, i-add natin sa ating numerator na 3. Then we get 28. Then copy the denominator. Okay, that is on how to rename mixed number to improper fraction. Example number 2. 2 and 3 fourth. Okay? Gawin ulit natin kung ano yung ginawa natin sa una. So, multiply 4 times 2 is equal to 8 plus 3 is equal to 11 over 4. Okay? Paano ulit nakuha? Ganun pa din. Multiply the, new, the denominator by the whole number plus the new numerator. 4 times 2 plus 3 over 4. Next example. 3 and 2 thirds. The improper fraction is 11 over 3. Okay? 3 times 3 is equal to 9, plus 2 is equal to 11, copy the denominator, which is 3. Okay? So, multiply the, the denominator by the whole number, plus the numerator, or 3 times 3, plus 2, over 3. So, now let us proceed to our topic for today, multiplying a fraction by its reciprocal is equal to 1. Bago tayo pumunta sa ating lesson, narito muna ang mga keywords na dapat natin tandaan. Una, multiplicative inverse. Anong ibig sabihin nito? The word meaning of inverse is something opposite in effect like reciprocal. So, malalaman nyo ito mamaya pag uh, sa pagpapatuloy ng ating discussion. Then another one, what is reciprocal? Reciprocal is one of a pair of numbers that when multiplied with another number equals the number 1. Example, if we have the number 7, the multiplicative inverse or reciprocal would be 1 over 7 because when you multiply 7, and 1 over 7 together, you get 1. Okay, so tingnan itong mga ibang example na to. 3, the reciprocal is 1 over 3 or 1 thirds. 1 half, the reciprocal is 2 over 1. And 3 and 3 fifths, the reciprocal is 5 over 18. Paano ba gagawin natin para makuha natin ang reciprocal ng number or fraction or mixed number? First, in this case, use 1 as the numerator 
and the denominator will be the whole number. Okay? Next. In this case, just flip the numerator and the denominator. Pagbalik ta rin lang natin. Itong denominator dito, gawin natin siyang numerator. At saka yung numerator dito, gawin natin siyang denominator. So, the reciprocal of 1 half is 2 over 1. Next. So, in this case, convert mixed number to improper fraction, then flip the improper fraction. Okay. Kaya nang ginawa natin kanina, 5 times 3 is equal to 15 plus 3 is equal to 18. So, 18 over 5. To get the reciprocal, ang ating denominator dito ay magiging numerator at ang ating uh, numerator doon ay magiging denominator. Nag-change nag lang sila ng pwesto. So moving on, that multiplying a fraction by its reciprocal is equal to 1. So 3 over 7. If you are going to multiply this 3 over 7 to its reciprocal, ang makukuha nating sagot ay 1. Tanong, ano ang reciprocal ng 3 over 7? So, the reciprocal is 7 over 3. So, yung uh, numerator naging denominator, yung denominator naman naging numerator. Then, if you are going to multiply, 3 times 7 and 7 times 3 is equal to 21 over 21. And if you are going to convert it, it is equal to 1. So let us proceed to our next example. 2 over 5. Multiply it by its reciprocal. So ano ang reciprocal ng 2 fifths? That is 5 half. Then if you are going to multiply 2 times 5, then 5 times 2 is equal to 10 over 10 or equal to 1. Next example, 8. What is the reciprocal of 8? The reciprocal of 8 is 1 over 8. Then if you're going to multiply, so 8 times 1 is equal to 8 over 8. Or that is equivalent to 1. Next example, 2 and 3 fourths. What is the, the reciprocal of 2 and 3 fourths? First, we are going to convert mixed number to improper fraction. Paano natin gagawin to? Okay? Multiply denominator by whole number plus the new numerator. Okay? So, let us do. So, 4 times 2 is equal to 8 plus 3 is equal to 11 over 4. So, yung 4, kopihin lang natin dito sa baba. And then, let us find out the reciprocal of 11 over 4. What is the reciprocal? It is 4 over 11. Then, let us multiply. 11 times 4, then 4 times 11, the answer is 44 over 44 or equivalent to 1. Okay, so this time we will have our activity challenge. Okay, so we have here challenge for you. So get a sheet of paper or any scratch paper para doon yung lagay yung sagot nyo for the meantime. Let me check natin yan mamaya. Number one question is, give the reciprocal of 6 over 17. 2. What is the reciprocal of the sum of 2 fifths and 4 fifths? 3. Get the reciprocal of 4 and 3 over 7. And the multiplicative inverse of 3 over 7 times 2 over 7. So, are you ready? So, umpisa na natin. Bibigyan ko kayo ng 20 
seconds or two, two minutes to answer the question. So if you're ready, let's start. In. Okay, time's up. Let us answer. What is the reciprocal of 6 over 17? The answer is 17 over 6. Now, what is the reciprocal of the sum of, the sum of 2 fifth and 4 over 5 or 4 fifth? Okay, first, we're going to get the sum. 2 fifth plus 4 fifth is equal to 6 over 5 or 6 fifth. The reciprocal is 5 over 6. Get the reciprocal of 4 and 3 over 7. Okay? So 7 times 4 plus 3 over 7. So the answer is 31 over 7. The reciprocal is 7 over 31. Then the multiplicative inverse of 3 over 7 times 2 over 7. Yes. Let us multiply first. 3 times 2 is equal to 6. Then 7 times 7 is equal to 49. So the multiplicative inverse is 49 over 6. So, dyan na naman nagtatapos ang ating uh, uh, lesson sa araw na to. Okay? Sana uh, nagbigay ulit ako ng kunting kalaman para sa lesson na to. Maraming salamat po sa lahat ng mga subscribers at mga nag-share ng aking mga video sa kanilang mga estudyante na si Ma'am Susie, Ma'am Nancy, kay Sir Joy B, kay Ma'am Anna, kay Ma'am Helen, kay Ma'am Tessie, kay Ma'am Nora Fe ng Isabela, kay Ma'am Angeline at kay Ma'am Angeline. Maraming maraming salamat po. God bless po. Sana ay patuloy pong suportahan ang aking YouTube channel. That ends with our discussion for today. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and click the notification bell for more updates. Again, this is Teacher Rai saying goodbye and God bless everyone. See you on my next video. Paalam! Thank you so much.